The new Fiat Superstrada. Inside, it's been restyled with a new dashboard and electronic check panel. Yet outside, the shape is the same. Because the Strada's unique design gives more passenger space. How much more? Well, enough to fit our biggest rival, the Ford Escort, inside. I've got you under my skin. Yet it still costs £694 less than the Escort. The new Fiat Superstrada. More space, less money. In a week, when we took 12 pages to brief you on the real significance of the video revolution, when we explained how a 36-year-old is shaking up ICL, in a week, when we analyzed the interest rate crisis and told you why it may not go away, what was your point of view? No FT. No comment. Coco Pops, spinning tops, Coco Pops, pit stops, snow drops, chocolate flavor, Coco Pops, clippity claps, bunny hops, balloon bops, milk drops, Coco Pops, Jack in the box, Mrs. Mops, Mr. Spox, Keystone Cops, for nothing tops, get us Coco Pops. I was eating Rice Krispies the night you were born, Katie. Ah, Doug came in. Why does she eat and says, you've got a sister? Flipping heck, I said. Have some Rice Krispies. Better snap, crackle and pop old bright nose up. And he said, as long as she's got your mother's looks and her brains, she won't do too bad. No sign of any brains. She hasn't even started eating Rice Krispies yet. Kellogg's Rice Krispies with vitamins and iron. Have you heard how good they are? short while the light fluffy sponge rose through the delicious sauce and McDougal's saucy sponge always a happy ending now here is a short recitation about a man who won fortune and fame by making a right special flower Tom Allinson, that was his name. For just after the Industrial Revolution, all but he were for bread white as snow. They thought it were purer than oatmeal. But young Tom in a loud voice said, No, no white bread's all right, that I'll grant you. But you've taken away some of clout. Oatmeal's better all told for young people, because it's bread that's had nout taken out. And now, over hundred years later, it's been proved beyond reasonable doubt to a Tom Allinson's thoughts that were proper and bread's better. We now take out. Biscuits from McVitie's.
Come what may, there'll never be anything to beat the goodness of Hovis Handy Loaf. With five times more wheat germ than even wholemeal bread, it'll be as good for you tomorrow as it's always been. like to take you on a journey through the splendors of Cheshire, Leicester, and Wensleydale to new territory, cheddar with walnuts, with white wine and mustard, double Gloucester with chives and onions. St. Ivel have discovered a wonderful country. Now go out and eat it. New St. Ivel cheese wedges. your food, why not show it? Let's have a big hand for fish and chips. How about a round of applause for hamburgers? Now let's hear it for the good old banger. Not forgetting, of course, fish fingers. And last but not least, a really big hand for the great British breakfast. Yes, love? Uh, the menu, please. There's pie and chips, chop and chips, steak and chips, sausage and chips, chicken and chips, place and chips, place, peas and No chips. matter how much you love chips, there are times when you need a change. 
So Ross have brought out oven crunches. Real pieces of potato baked in the oven. They're as tasty as chips, only different. Well, oven crunches. With chips? Oven crunches from Ross, the name that stands out in the freezer. I am the greatest. I'm three times heavyweight champion of the world, as pretty as I was the day I started. I'll be remembered as the greatest heavyweight champion of all time. I'm so great, I don't realize how great I am. I'm afraid of nobody. Son, eat your burger. Yes, Mama. What do big mouths have for tea? The bird's eye quarter pounder, packed with beef. It takes a big mouth to eat a big burger. The great thing about a wall steak and kidney pie is that it's made with real steak. Thick and juicy, and lots of it. Well, plenty of kidney, too. All wrapped in lovely, rich, short crust pastry. It's great. Walls would like to make clear to those viewers expecting to see the other Ian Botham that they're sorry, but they feel that with a product as famous as theirs, any old Ian Botham will do. Walls, steak and kidney pies. It's the way we make them that makes them famous. soup would always make things better. Granddad, the water's freezing. You dive into the science tomato soup. The first time I swam the Atlantic. God, that must have been perishing. Aye, lad. Luckily, QE2 were around, and they revived me with a hot mug of Heinz soup. I felt so much better after that. I swam as fast as boat. How did you keep up with the QE2, Grandad? I was in there swimming pools, son! Hind soup would always make things better. Next Tuesday, all over Britain, there'll be a mad rush for Jif Real Lemon Juice. Get yours now. Tomorrow morning, take the plunge. Dive into a grapefruit. The all-round breakfast food. No pips, no peel, no pip, no powder, just juice. No oils, no acids, no preservatives, just juice. No salt, no sugar, no corn, no color, no food, no sucrose, and no dextrin. No flavoring, no stabilizing, just juice. And this unseeded British youngster really has Borg worried now. We could be on the verge here of the biggest upset in Wimbledon's history. A lovely backhand on the line pulls Borg out of position. Now a cross-court forehand, he's got such good footwork. He plays a perfect approach and he moves in and puts the ball away superbly. Five games to four, final set. Just one game away from the title. Robinson's barley water. Anything else just isn't tennis. Championship point now. And yes, he's done it! Hey, well, Mr. Phelps. Top top. I don't want to miss my bet. Leave that. We haven't got time. So it's number two at air then. Aye. Benji number two. 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 Go on, boy. McEwen's export. Rich and substantial. With a distinctive taste. You'll really need to save her. They're going behind at air. <laughs> Usual five or a number two at air for the lads. And they're off at air. McEwen's export. Same again. The one you'll want to stay with. And a banger for Benji. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
from work, Peter Gelder and his friend Jan discover a disastrous situation. There appears to be a hole in the dike. Peter acts immediately. Roughly translated, he says, you fetch help Jan and I'll pluck the hole with my finger. But there's a problem. Peter's finger is a little too small. So he opens a can of Europe's most popular beer, the cold, refreshing Heineken. Immediately his finger is ready for action. And this time it is a perfect fit. Only Heineken can do this because it refreshes the parts other beers cannot reach. And now Peter waits patiently for help. My goodness, let's hope it comes soon. What's that you're drinking? Heather cream. For the bonny bells of Heather, they brewed a drink lang syne. That's the malt whiskey. That means it's very good. It was sweeter far than honey. That's the double cream. That means it's very, very good. You can? Oh, I can, I can. It was stronger, aye, stronger. Stronger far than wine. That means it's... Yes? That means it's finished. <laughs> I've had a long innings on this John Smith sign. In fact, I've been here since 1909. I wish that bowler there could knock off these bales, because I reckon I deserve a pint of Big John Smith's ale. It's Big John. Big John. Big John. Now that brings my score to five million and two. My faithful old bat is nearly worn through. Hmm, must be a woodworm. Well, who'd have thought that? Now for the big bit of taste of John Smith's, how's that? Big John. Big John. You know, Jeeves, there's only one snack about spending the weekend here with Lord Glastonbury. His Lordship's sherry, sir. Absolutely, Jeeves. That's why, sir, I took the liberty of bringing a bottle of your Croft original. Oh, Jeeves. Top hole! Beats me why the old buffer doesn't get some in. Lord Glastonbury is very set in his way, sir. I fear he regards a cream sherry like Croft original, with its light, delicate colour, somewhat too modern for him. I shall nectar, Jeeves. Compared with his jolly old brown stuff, Croft's a clear winner. I say, Jeeves, clear winner. That's a joke. I don't know, though, sir. Craft original pale cream sherry. One instinctively knows when something is right. Well, I've been working hard to reach me target. To earn a few bob to take me down to market. The winkles took some chewing, but the rain was nice and warm. On the way to the pub, I fell in love, but I don't think much of your No, I don't reckon you're one. Roll up your trousers. Car is best, mate. Wash out your gills and jelly dills are good for your brain. With car is best, mate. You could keep the cost of brava. I'm telling you, mate, I'd rather have a pint of car is best down market in the rain. Car Remember a pint at best. Courage do. For every great people, history has a purpose. The people of Romford could have invented television if they'd chosen to. Forget it, love. There's nothing on for 53 years. Romford men considered uh, splitting the atom first. Go on. So small already, it's hardly worth the bother. They had thought of breaking the four-minute mile. No need John be a bus along in a minute. No, Romford was saving itself for a greater glory. John Ball Bitter from 
the Romford Brewery Company. Romford's destiny fulfilled. In points. People say things have changed, but there's a lot that hasn't. Ben Truman is still brewed with the same traditional skill and care. That's why it's as true today as it's always been. You can taste the hops in Ben Truman. created an even better cup of tea. They've searched the universe for a better blend for their tea bags. And the bags themselves have been specially designed to let all the flavor of the new blend flow through. PG Tips new Flavor Flow tea bags for one of the best tasting cups of tea ever created. you that very special Cadbury's chocolate taste with the goodness of malt. Good night's taste of Cadbury's. With Born Vita, good night's taste of Life can be full and rich if you can stand the pace. So you need a coffee with a bigger taste. When you're feeling like you gotta pick yourself up, you need a bigger taste right in your coffee cup. Move up to Brooklyn Red Mountain with the richer roasted darker coffee taste. Move up to Brooklyn Red Mountain. Move up. Every day, life's a little brighter, Purcell Automatic gets it whiter, fresh clean clothes to begin each new day. Hey, 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 every day looks a little whiter, every way. Colors are brighter, that's the way Personal Automatic gets you washing clean Personal Automatic gives you superb results on everything you wash It's tested and approved by all these machine makers Bright and white, the Personal Automatic way Hey, hey, hey Here, mums, it's about time we had a few things out in the open. 
you're after our Johnson's baby bath and don't think we haven't noticed. We know its gentle foam and delicate perfume are hard to resist. We can understand you wanting smooth, baby soft skin. But at our expense, have you no shame? Ooh, ooh, ooh. Johnson's baby bath keeps you soft and smooth from top to bottom. Zilda here has got a complaint, haven't you, Zilda? Her mum has been stealing Zilda's cotton buds to put on makeup, apply ointment, clean round her ears, no end of things, and without so much as a buy or leave. Honestly, mums, you really must buy your own cotton buds and stop taking advantage of defenseless little mites like <laughs> Zilda, please. There might be children watching. Johnson's cotton buds for everyone's important little places. No nonsense, sure for men. A powerful antiperspirant deodorant, especially for men. Super dry, sure for men. Helps stop wetness, helps stop odor, even when the going gets tough. It's one sure way to be sure. looks beautiful when it's just been washed. With new InfoSoft Baby Shampoo, you could wash it every single day of the week because InfoSoft is a baby shampoo that conditions your hair while it gently cleans it, keeping the shine that frequent washing can take out so your hair looks healthy and beautiful. New InfoSoft Baby Shampoo from Milton. Now you can wash your hair every day without harming a hair of your head. I'm going you can't follow, but I've got to do you can't be any part of. You're getting on that plane. No, Richard, no. Listen, if that plane leaves the ground and you're not on it, you'll regret it. But what about us? We'll always have Paris. Say, not so fast. Name off by Cootie. Makes it a little harder to say goodbye. Is that the time? Color Fast by Max Factor. Taxi! By 11. Copy, Jane. The designer file. Table for two. Thousand. Ooh. Jane T. W.A. New York. Hold on. Dada. Goodbye. Hello, darling. You look marvelous. Nice easy day. Color Fast. New long-lasting colors for lips, nails, eyes, and face to stay as beautiful as the day is long. Get up, Rosequack! Right, boys, now over you go! Ah! Sarge! Brownlee! Now, don't you fret, Mrs. Brownlee. Only the best for my lads. An afterfloor, airstrip, waterproof. Recruits, oh. with use of... Oh. There, there, Ooh. there. And, of course, an elastoplast fabric, where we want a little extra cushioning. Elastoplast. There, there, there. Tricks, bayonets! Ow! Brownlee! My George is a real bore when he's getting a cold. The way he carries on, you'd think he was on his last legs. But Disprin soon reduces his temperature and helps ease the aches and pains. Disprin is gentle, and it dissolves before you take it. In fact, Disprin helps gently dissolve away cold symptoms. Next time your old man's been a bit of a bore, give him Disprin. There's a cigar called Hamlet, the mild cigar.
Happiness is a cigar called Hamlet. The mild cigar. A warning to anyone who tries a new harvest crunch far from Quaker. They're extremely nutty. There's nuts, rolled oats, nuts, whole wheat, honey, and nuts in New Harvest Crunch Bar from Quaker. But watch out for the squirrels. T'as fait les courses, il te faut pas, je sais pas moi, enfin ça fait trois heures que j'attends moi dans ce café, j'en peux plus. Oh bah il y avait de la circulation. Il y avait de la circulation, enfin voyons, il te faut pas trois heures pour acheter une baguette, des légumes et de la viande, non Enfin tout ça pour, pour un repas pour deux personnes, enfin allons, de plus moi, j'arrête pas de me coller du café, alors ah ah, quel café Trois heures de paraffine, là, là, j'en ai là, total. Et qu'est-ce que c'est que ça vous faites Oh bah ça c'est un petit truc anglais. Angle, anglais, oh ça alors Et, et, oh, hein, et qu'est-ce que c'est que cette viande là au fait Ma mère vient pour le week-end. Ah non Ah non Ah non Onion fries from Smith's. New, crunchy, formidable. Everest Solaronic Patio Doors. Beautiful. Double glazed with a three quarter inch air gap for optimum thermal insulation. A real effective thermal barrier. And a unique Everest Espanolet lock. Locking top and bottom at the same time. Everest draft proofing, of course. And now, here's a little test that you can do on the glass. Okay, Jim? Everest tough and safety glass, which is standard. Now you only fit double glazing once, so fit the best. Everest.
Oh well, better get the chips on. Fred will be home in a minute. Red alert, she's doing chips next door. The way to fry chips without panic is with Tefal's new Super Fry Deluxe with filter, special locking device, thermostat, timer and remote control basket. So it not only makes delicious chips, it takes the fear out of frying. The new Tefal Super Fry. Uh, do you think this marriage will last? No chance. Oh, goodness me, why ever not? Her cooking's a joke. Oh, dear. And as for his cooking, yuck. Well, I do have one suggestion. It better be good. Oh, it is good. The new world Manhattan. It's gas, it has click-stop simmer control, high-level grill, automatic timer, a bright oven light, a Tysine-lined oven that cleans as it cooks. Nice one. And it looks as dishy as a spring bride. Oh. Get them a new world Manhattan and they'll cook happily ever after. Oh. <laughs> Got the picture? Mm. Yeah. Ladies. Look, those awfully nice early people are rather worried you might have found their last hi-fi commercial a bit objectionable, you know, implying you're more interested in the way a hi-fi looks than the way it sounds. A bit sexist, eh? So, how about this fantastic new hi-fi, ladies? Direct drive, super slim amp, stereo tuner, and girls, a Dolby cassette deck with full logic control. And just so hubby gives it house room, easy to clean glass lid and door, posh walnut look cabinet, and still no spaghetti for him to trip over when he's hoovering. Hello, wife's home. Better put on a favourite tune. More hi-fi, less hassle. Is it there, darling? From Sony. Those awfully nice Sony people want me to tell you what makes my Sony Twiniton so unique. But I'm not going to. All that jargon about one electron lens instead of three. Very boring. This is what you're interested in. A brighter, sharper picture. Delicious. That'll look good even longer than she will. Look at those cakes. Good enough to eat, aren't they? In fact, I think I will eat one. Hmm. Wonder if there's anything to eat on BBC One. Yeah, football. Oh, snooker. That's much better. Sony Trinitron. A more lifelike picture. A longer lasting set. Hmm. Always like the strawberry ones. Oi! Give me my ball back. Those awfully nice Sony people want me to tell you about their amazing portables. Trouble is, they're so small, I'm not really the right man for the job. So, let's give my understudy his big chance. Off you go, sport. This little chap's a Sony Digicube. You've never seen a clock radio like it. This radio is no bigger than a book, yet it picks up Moscow. And now, the famous Sony Walkman cassette player. The world's smallest personal high park. So lightweight, you hardly know you're wearing it. Oi, I haven't finished yet. I haven't told them about this. Sony Portables. Great sounds in little packages. In 1945, when the Tories came to power in our town hall, the door was painted blue. Long came Labour, and it was painted red. Followed by the Tories, then Labour, surprise independence, Tory, Liberal, Labour, Tory, then, at long last, new peel-off Ron Strip. Mix with water, spread it on, leave for a few hours, simply peel off, and wood is back to its natural beauty. New peel-off Ron Strip removes 10 coats of paint and 36 years of politics in one go. Black & Decker Electric Planer, only £29.99. <laughs> These people are playing a game called Jungle Fever. You just have to guess what animal the others are supposed to be. And they have to guess what you are. 
jungle fever from ideal. After you played it, other games seem rather tame. don't want to keep paying out for umbrellas to break, make sure your next umbrella is a Canucks. Because all Canucks umbrellas are made with extra strength steel spokes. That won't break, whatever the weather. 32 turnings are allowed to just pop it back. You see, all Canucks umbrellas are designed to last as long as you do. Maybe even longer! Also, in a fashionable range of women's umbrellas, you can break a bra but you can't connect her a Canucks. This Ferrari has four whistlings which make it go very fast. This new paper mate Eclipse has a unique pump action which ensures an even flow of ink to the point even upside down. The Eclipse is guaranteed for life, yet actually costs less than the Ferrari. And when it comes to writing your thank you letters, it leaves the Ferrari standing. The new Eclipse. Is it any wonder that there'll be more paper mates than Ferraris in our stockings this Christmas? Patrick, 5th Earl of Litchfield, is also a professional photographer. Even when he's not working, he likes to keep his hand in. With the Olympus XA2. It's so fast it doesn't miss a shot. There's no lens cap or case. Just slide back the cover and shoot. The XA2 has a 35mm Zico lens, simple focusing, automatic exposure, and a flash unit. The Olympus XA2, what a pro uses when he's not taking pictures. Brown study, no nonsense, whitewash, green fingers, no nonsense, orange squash, yellow barrel, no nonsense, red kiss, blue print, no nonsense, black list. No nonsense cartridge pens, ball pens, and rolling ball pens by Schaefer for brighter writers. There's been a delivery down at the zoo. The new Fiat Panda. The Panda is roomy enough to carry food for even the biggest mouth. And a nippy 900cc engine makes it the quickest meals on wheels service around. The rugged, roomy panda. For the zoo family, it's the perfect family car. The new Fiat Panda. In a range of six colors. And original black and white. I'd never driven the new Granada, so Bob and I swapped cars for the weekend. After a day like I'd just had, it was nice to get some peace. His car was a Gear, a 1982 model with the 2.8 fuel injected engine. And he'd chosen all the latest equipment. I had 200 miles to go and I was beginning to rather look forward to it. Why does it always rain on Fridays? The corners don't feel quite as sharp as usual. Makes all the difference, the new suspension. Hmm, that was easy. 
I wonder if Bob likes my car as much as I like his. You'll never believe how good the new Granada is until you drive it. This is the new BMW 5 Series. A range of cars so electronically advanced it's taken us all week to tell you about it. Some can decelerate even from 70 miles per hour without using a drop of petrol. Others can brake without skidding, even in the wet. And it's the first car in the world that doesn't have a regular service interval. 1.8 to 2.8 liters, the new BMW 5 Series the ultimate driving machine. This is the new BMW 5 Series. A car so advanced it's taking us all week to tell you about it. Last night it's remarkable anti-skid brakes. Tonight, how some models can travel without using petrol. Take your foot off the accelerator above 1200 RPM and the car's computer cuts off the petrol completely, even at 70 miles per hour. Conventional cars still use petrol when they slow down. Keep an eye on the fuel consumption indicator and you could save up to 10% on your petrol bill. The new BMW 5 Series, the ultimate driving machine. This is a new generation of cars. Cars so electronically advanced, it's going to take us all week to tell you about the innovations. So at this time, every evening this week, we'll be showing you a different commercial. Starting tomorrow, we'll show you why it's the first car in the world that doesn't have a regular service interval. The new BMW 5 Series, the ultimate driving machine. This is the new BMW 5 Series. Put yourself in the driving seat of a car so advanced it's taking us all week to tell you about it. Tonight we'll show you how it's the first car in the world that doesn't have a regular service interval. Drive hard like this and your car may need servicing every 10,000 miles. Take it easy like this and you could go 15,000 miles between services. It tells you the precise moment it needs an oil change or a service. Tomorrow we'll show you how you can stand on the brakes without skidding, even in the wet. The new BMW 5 Series, the ultimate driving machine. I'm from the tax office. Oh, many have returns. If you're as poor as you claim, how can you afford four cars? It's a BL double bonus, old boy. Saved a bundle on them, and there's lots more in them. Go on, you're sitting pretty. Oh, it's the seats in this new Mini. New soundproofing, less servicing, and turns on the sixpence. Not that I can afford sixpence. Come off it, you're no short. Well, nobody is compared with you. Got a great deal on the new Allegro, too. With the Metro A-plus engine for economy, Metro soundproofing, and comfy new seats. Can I look over your new HL? Not without a ladder. This new 1.7 is faster than the Mercedes 200. Only takes four hours to the villa. Villa? Aston Villa. I almost believed you up to now were a princess. I'm not buying that. Good, I'm not selling it. It's so economical to run, I couldn't afford to. You really are poor, aren't you? Oh, as a church mouse, old boy. Do you know I could only afford to buy one golf club? Five iron? Glen Eagles, on your bike. Why not see your BL dealer? The BL double bonus could save you a fortune. A small fortune in his case. Wouldn't it be nice if you could let your car get its own oil and petrol? Well, it knows more about oil and petrol than you do.
chances are it'd take itself off to its nearest Texaco station. Because a car knows you can't buy a better oil and petrol. It's here again, Harry. Right, I'll have a word with it about these bills. Trust Texaco. Your car does. Hello, I've come to pay my bill. Had a nice holiday, have we money? Good. There we are. It can't be all that. I see. No stranger to the bar, were we? Oh. A la carte everything. Papers, laundry. Oh. Access. Hello, money. Let me pay and we can settle up later. Oh, he's ever so helpful. I know. He's always there when you need him. I know. Access. Your flexible friend. I know. Now, Harkness, you are going to show me what you're reading under the desk during mess. Something uplifting, full of artistic pictures of young ladies, I take it? No, sir. No? Oh. It is mass, really, sir. It's all about this new Halifax extra interest account. Mother wanted to know if it was any good. Indeed. You invest at least £1,000, and you're getting 9.25% net interest. Or with an investment of £10,000, you're up to 9.5%. Access to capital at three months' notice, with no loss of interest. Harkness, the Halifax appears to have solved the problem of paying high interest without tying up capital. And that is about as believable as you having a mother. Mother? Lydia? Arthur? The Halifax gets them together. High interest, easy access. If you have a family, you ought to know about an insurance plan from Legal and General that guarantees you a tax-free check every month if your husband should die. We're not saying that money could ever take his place, but it will help you to carry on. Legal and general, we cover the things you care for. Should something untoward happen to your house? No, sorry. You'll be glad it's covered by legal and general's house policy. What a shot! It's gone clean over the gasometer. Hmm. We know a check won't solve everything. But at least it's one problem you won't have to worry about. <laughs> At Legal and General, we cover the things you care for. Have you heard about the Whopper? Uh -huh. Well, that's not the only thing at Burger King. They got 100% Your beef every time Flame grill, never fry. 100% of everything. You're always gonna get it at Burger King. Have you heard about the Whopper? Uh-huh. Do you like the Whopper? Yum, yum. Well, that's not the only thing at Burger King. They got 100% of everything. You're always gonna get it at Burger King. Burger King, 100% USA. Every morning inside Presto Spacious Food Markets, we're busy putting in an enormous variety of food so that you won't have to go anywhere else. Don't go. Runner beans, French beans. Do not go. Dutch cheeses, Swiss cheeses. Don't go low. Wines and spirits, herbs and spices, pickles, island dressings, Canadian relishes, Chinese sauces. Don't go. A choice of over 4,000 grocery lines and all at Presto prices. So so you can get the whole week's food in one go without having to go anywhere else. Don't go. Presto, we don't want you to go anywhere else. That's the Presto Manifesto. There's only one way to make a real French loaf. You need real French flour with a dough mixed in a traditional French way. Matured for at least two hours. 
then baked in specially made ovens. The British baker taking this much trouble to bake French loaves and bake them in over 80 stores is Tesco. Today's Tesco, adding new values to value. Oh, blow the man down, bullies, blow the man down. Wait, blow the man down. Blow the man down, bullies, blow the man down. Give me some time to blow the man down. The gale, she is running far out of the deep. Wait, blow the man down. The lightning falls like a gash in the sea. Give me some time to blow the man down. The wind is a howling, the mouth is a bull. You can be sure of shell. Hundreds of factories, thousands of workers, and millions of pounds to help you make it in Wales. When you recall last year's Wimbledon, you'll be pleased to learn that this summer you can get 20 pounds off this gas fire. And after last year's Ascot, the good news is that this summer there's 30 pounds off this gas fire. And remember, Henley, well, cheer up. This summer, there's 40 pounds off this gas fire. These special offers are at your British gas showroom. So, change your old gas fire now, and you'll be nice and cosy for the final test. Did you know that one of the world's most modern copper mines is run by Britain's most experienced specialist Sioux animal feeder? <laughs> or that the world's most advanced system for turning rocks into home insulation is run by Britain's leading spacecraft lubricators. That is a giant step for a truck driver. Or that the most successful oil field in the North Sea is operated by Britain's biggest private taxpayer. One more for the tax man. Thank you. Did you know that fuel and oil for the farmers is supplied by one of Britain's most versatile computer programmers? <laughs> Where paint makers, gold miners, lubricators and refiners, sailing ships and farming fishes, finding gas and washing dishes, laying pipelines, drilling, testing, backing Britain by investing. BP. Britain at its best. It's a shame, shame, shame. Ooh, shame on you. If you can't come to me. Yes, it's a shame, shame, shame. If you can't come to me. If you're under 18 or over 30, you can't come on a Club 1830 holiday. Shame on you.
have a nice day. Tommy and Rod. After a business trip overseas. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Only we British can welcome you home. We have the widest seats across the Atlantic. Civilized service and experienced crew. Our flight this evening. In club or super club. Thanks. Come home with British Airways. Great story. An old wizard teaching kids tricks with cigarettes. Hmm, cigarettes. I don't like the sound of that. Up, up and away. Watch me, kids. One puff and they'll soon be in my grasp. <laughs> if it's a puff you want... It's the coating! Yeah! Foiled again! One thing you can't disguise, kids, the harm cigarettes do to you. That's why I never say yes to a cigarette. You are about to be taken on an unforgettable journey. Oh, God. Don't worry, mate. I won't be long. I'll, I'll get someone. I couldn't have been doing more than 20. Part the end, you're through his windscreen. Very still. You'll have to cut the sleeve. Severe facial lacerations, damage to the left eye. You'll never forget a trip through your windscreen, so remember to put on your seatbelt. Soon you may have to by law, but you can get into the habit now. Clunk, click. When I want them. I pull on the jeans that make me feel alright I put on Buddhas, I put my Buddhas jeans on When I want my jeans to feel good, I gotta feel, gotta feel Pairs of Wrangler jeans bursting out the door. One pair left his Viking bits, then there was four. Four pairs of Wrangler jeans with a flat old battery. One pair pushed a bit too hard, whoops, then there was three. Three pairs of Wrangler jeans standing in a queue. One pair knew the manager, then there was two. Brother says, Hello, well then there was one. Now the moral of this story is, if they desert you in the end, as long as you wear Wrangler, you've got a real two-legged friend. Yeah, I thought she went on. Oh, thank goodness, it's my postman. He's broken down. Oh, it's his shoes, love. I'll have to take him in for a service. Here, George, you got a pair of them clerks movers, size nine? See the way the sole turns up at the front and the back? That's why they're more comfortable, isn't it? I tell you, you'll be bounding around like a two-year-old. Suppose we'd better give him a test run then, George. <laughs> clerks movers, supremely comfortable shoes for men and women. The Sunday Times magazine is conducting a thorough examination of private medicine. Is it really the exclusive privilege of the rich? Artery forceps. Or the ultimate in medical science, available thanks to private medical insurance plans to all? And how much does it really cost? Did you remove all of it, sir? No. I'm going in again. Now, the Sunday Times magazine gives you the facts and explodes the fictions about private medicine. Sunday isn't Sunday without the Sunday Times.
In a week when we looked beyond President Sadat's murder and asked how the balance of power in the Middle East may change now, when we reported that your high street bank may soon be a thing of the past, in a week when we explained what the shake-up in European currencies could mean for Britain's hard-pressed exporters, what was your point of view? No FT. No comment. This week in The Standard, Alexander Walker on films. Delia Smith on cookery. Milton Shulman on theatre. Robert Carvel on politics. John Blake on Young London. Max Hastings on the Exiles. Humour by Angus McGill. <laughs> Only the best type of writers write for the standard. Jimmy Boyle is undeniably a great sculptor. <laughs> Do it, Jimmy! His work has a sense of force. James Boyle. This vicious murder leaves me no alternative. He's one of the most sensitive and skilled workers I've ever Get our slop back out of that cell, Boyle. Which is the real Jimmy Boyle? You'll see some of the story in A Sense of Freedom next Tuesday on ITV. The rest is in this week's TV Times, your complete guide to ITV programs. Oh, hello there. I'd like to tell you about my new album, The Pick of Billy Connolly. It's a collection of all my favourite stories and ditties. All good, clean family fun, of course. No swearing, no dirty bits, and nothing offensive. All shipshape and above board, clean as a whistle. The Pick of Billy Connolly. Good, clean family fun. It's The Pick of Billy Connolly! Please buy my latest album. It's a collection of all my favourite songs and stories. Because if you don't, you'll get yours, Jimmy. Here's a disco album that'll bowl you over. Sixteen original disco tracks, sixteen of the very latest disco hits. Get your skates on and roll on. This is a most unusual pen. It draws a clear, odorless line of insecticide anywhere in the home that tends to attract flies and crawling insects. Within minutes of a fly touching the line, it's dead. New Insectipen from Vapona spells the end for flies. Now Fisons are shrink wrapping their fertilizers for extra protection to cut the risk of caking, blocking and uneven application by keeping the damp out and freshness in. It's just one of the many practical ways we're helping Britain's farmers. Fisons. This lawn's just been mown by a Qualcast Concord. Next door, they're using a hover mower. Finish mowing, dear. Doesn't look like her lawn next door. No, oh, well, wait till I rake up the grass cuttings. You wanted a hover mower? You wouldn't have to rake them up if you had a mower like hers next door. Hers can't cut overgrown lawns and banks, my pet. Oh, yes, it can. <laughs> Oh, no! That wretched dog's walking grass into the house again. The Qualcast Concord. It cuts lower than a hover. It cuts long grass like a hover. It's tidier than a hover. 
Overall, it's even easier than a hover. Finish raking, dear. It still doesn't look like her lawn next door. No, I don't know why I bother. The Qualcast Concord. For a perfect lawn, it's a lot less bother than a hover. <laughs> look, look, see that? This was just a say, look. <laughs> I tell you what I'm going to do now. I'm going to add this new nurture to the plant on the left to make it bigger than the plant on the right. Nurture water. Add new nurture when you water, water and in a few weeks you'll see the difference. Nurture water. Nurture water. There's a nurture nurture with extra nitrogen to make leafy plants grow leafier. Nurture water. Nurture water. Nurture water. And one with extra potassium to help flowering plants flower. Nurture water. New nurture plant food works like magic. If I can get it right, anyone can. <laughs> In my business, you've got to show your face around. Otherwise, people can forget you real easy. So I got me one of these Minolta EP530R plain paper copiers. It takes two sizes, copies both sides, and even reduces. But here's the clincher. The EP530R has this unique microtelling system which produces such look-alike copies. It would take a private eye to tell a difference. So if you're like me, then you have to maintain your image. Take my advice. Get a Minolta EP530R. Here's looking at me, kid. Get this to New York, a copy to Dubai, and one to Hong Kong. If you've got business documents or small packages that need to be somewhere in a hurry, don't just send them, DHL them. We are fast, reliable, and reasonably priced, with offices in every part of the world. Call us today. Now 
the world's greatest love story becomes a motion picture you'll never forget. Thrill to its splendor. Serve Captain Butler his coffee, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Keep the coffee pot, ma'am. No, oh, it does. Go oh, there, come there, do that. Serve everybody right around, come there. It's cold. Heart-stirring romance. You won't lock your door tonight. I'm going to have to put something in his coffee every night. Hair-raising drama. Scarlet! Damn Yankees is coming! Fiddle-dee-dee. Hide the coffee and I'll go away. Terrifying tension. You know what I want. Ah! Did you have one lamp or two? You can't go. I... I love you. Frankly, my dear, I don't give a damn. Scenes that stay in your heart forever. He didn't stay for his coffee. Well, a few minutes more. The film they said could never be made from the coffee you just can't stop making. After all, tomorrow is another day. Oh, blow the man down, bullies, blow the man down. Way, blow the man down. Blow the man down, bullies, blow the man down. Give me some time to blow the man down. The gale, she is running far out of the deep. Way. If we told you that a certain oil company wanted to push a pipeline through this lovely Welsh valley, a pipeline which would stretch for 78 miles across the countryside, which would cut a swathe 30 yards wide, which would mean digging seven feet down into the earth, sending bulldozers into the Snowdonia National Park, you would probably, quite rightly, be very alarmed. You might, with good reason, form a protest committee, ask for a special inquiry, write in the strongest terms to your MP. You needn't worry. This is the valley after, not before Shell laid its pipeline. Work began only after Shell had consulted the local people. And when work finished, we restored the valley, as you can see, to its natural beauty. Can we develop the industry we need without destroying our countryside? You can be sure of Shell. Excuse me, could you tell me the way to the library? Oh, I go, go round to the three ferries. Turn left. This show John Smith's bitter there, you know. Uh, go past the Merry Monk, they don't. Till you get to the Dragon's Tail, they do. Then right at the Swan. Oh, they serve a lovely pint there. Hang on, I'll come with you. John Smith's bitter. For book lovers everywhere. No wonder you've got a cold. Out with that dog over those moors for hours on end. Tonto must have his exercise, pet. I suppose I'll have to take him tonight. <coughs> Who wants to see all the little bunny bunnies then? <coughs> You're late tonight, Tonto. Hello, Tonto. John Smith's bitter. Nicer than bunny bunnies. You missed your pint of John Smith last night. My sister was teaching me French. La porte. What's that? The door. What's my pint of John Smith's is tinged with the colours of a sunset over Scarsdale Crag? I don't know. Well, there's no good knowing the advanced stuff when you haven't learned the basics, is it? John Smith's bitter. It is good. Life can be full and rich if you can stand the pace So you need a coffee with a bigger taste When you're feeling like you gotta pick yourself up You need a bigger taste right in your coffee cup Move 
drove up to Brooklyn Red Mountain with the richer roast, the darker coffee taste. Move up to Brooklyn Red Mountain. Move up to the big Move up to the big taste. Life can be full and rich if you can stand the pace. So you need a coffee with a bigger taste. When you're feeling like you gotta pick yourself up, you need a bigger taste right in your coffee cup. Move up to Brooklyn Red Mountain with the richer roasted darker coffee taste. Move up to Brooklyn Red Mountain. Move up. Life can be full and rich if you can stand the pace. So you need a coffee with a bigger taste. When you're feeling like you gotta pick yourself up, you need a bigger taste right in your coffee cup. Move up to Brooklyn Red Mountain with the richer roasted darker coffee taste. Move up to Brooklyn Red Mountain. Move up. There's only one way to make a real French loaf. You need real French flour with a dough mixed in a traditional French way. Matured for at least two hours, then baked in specially made ovens. The British baker taking this much trouble to bake French loaves and bake them in over 80 stores is Tesco. Today's Tesco, adding new values to value. You might find it surprising, but there's a greengrocer near you who insists on knowing the farms that supply him, who makes sure everything on the bottom of his shelves is as good as everything on the top. From the pick of the more well-known crops, to the more exotic. The greengrocer taking that much care is Tesco. Today's Tesco, adding new values to value. You can tell a master butcher by the way he selects the best, by the way he prepares the best by the way he cuts off what you do want, and by the way he cuts off what you don't want. By the way, there are butchers just like this, taking so much care behind the scenes in so many Tesco stores. Today's Tesco, adding new values to value. Happiness is a cigar called Hamlet, the mild cigar. Cigar called Hamlet, the mild cigar.
Those awfully nice Cerny people want me to tell you what makes my Cerny Triniton so unique. But I'm not going to. All that jargon about one electron lens instead of three. Very boring. This is what you're interested in. A brighter, sharper picture. Delicious. That look good even longer than she will. Look at those cakes. Good enough to eat, aren't they? In fact, I think I will eat one. Hmm. Wonder if there's anything to eat on BBC One. Yeah, football. No, oh, snooker. That's much better. Sony Trinitron. A more lifelike picture. A longer lasting set. Mm. Always like the strawberry ones. Oi! Give me my ball back. Little treasures. I thought they'd never settle down. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Whose turn is it tonight? Oh, well. Once upon a time, in a land far, far away, there lived a wise old toucan. Oh. In a week when we concluded that early retirement may not be an easy way of creating new jobs for the young, when we revealed why the Guinness toucan has suddenly hopped from one advertising agency to another. In a week when we explained why President Reagan is being forced to rethink his economic policies after only a year in office. What was your point of view? No FT. No comment. Oh, you uh, you got soap stock set. Hmm. Got to bang a race set myself. Oh, yeah. You bang the races from Skelextric. My bang a race should do U turns. U turns, U turns. So do my super stocks. U turns, U turns. Maybe we could have a. Uh... Super stocks are bang a race. Skelextric. Super stocks are bang a race.